actually had a girl come back to my apartment and tell me that she's texting her friend my address. Feel bad women have to do weird things to feel safe now? I was at this bar, this girl next to me put a napkin over her drink. I asked her why, and she's like, so I don't get roofied. I'm like, yeah, what kind of evil mastermind could infiltrate this airtight security system? <laughs> like, was she expecting to go to the bathroom and come back to a bunch of pills on the napkin? <laughs> like, oh, that was close. <laughs> if you're that concerned, shouldn't you keep the drink with you? If I think my wallet's gonna get stolen, I don't leave it on the bar covered in Kleenex. I wonder if the police ask this question when they're investigating roofie crime. Like, ma'am, did you put the napkin over the drink? You did? All right, looks like we're dealing with the professional boys. <laughs> but I feel women have to worry about their safety. I was on a date with this girl. We're going back to my apartment for the first time, and she's like, wait, you're not a serial killer, right? <laughs> like, she jumped straight to serial killer. I'm like, so you're saying if I killed one person, you're not concerned. <laughs> That's how low women have set the bar for men. And they're like, well, as long as it's not a pattern. <laughs> I mean, we all make mistakes. Let's see where this goes. I actually had a girl come back to my apartment and tell me that she's texting her friend my address. So if anything happened to her, her friend would know where I lived. So I killed her, then I moved. Thank you for plotting murder. <laughs> Not having good luck with dating, guys. Uh, I just got dumped after a third date, which is the worst amount of time to get dumped. After three dates, they're basically saying, I was mildly attracted to you until I barely got to know you. Now I never want to see you again. <laughs> what sucks about getting dumped after a third date is you know they weren't having fun after dates one and two. But their friends are like, you always date jerks, you should give this guy a chance. But after three dates with me, they're like, yo, forget this, I'm going back to the jerks. <laughs> Just tired of the games we have to play, guys. Like, I this girl out, yeah, you know, this guy knows, already. I asked this girl out on a fifth date. She's like, I'm fine with hanging out with you, but I'm not interested in sleeping with you. I'm like, well, suddenly I'm not interested in hanging out. <laughs> then she got angry with me. She's like, that means you just want sex. But that's not fair, ladies, okay? I don't just want sex. I want sex also. <laughs> There's a difference. If I order a pizza, I don't just want cheese. But if it doesn't have cheese, I don't want the damn pizza. 